slide. So it's hard for us to understand, okay, if that person won two rounds and this guy won three rounds, how does he win the fight? But in true tie scoring, it's based on like the percentage of the round. So if you only won rounds one through three by like 10% each round, and then I had a huge round four and a huge round five, that margin's gonna be bigger. So even though it's two to three, some guy, sometimes the guy with two, two rounds one can win. That's true. So if you're watching fights in Thailand, you're like, man, I thought that like guy won. It's, it's, it's more so, I mean, more so done there. You don't see it as much here. Some guys sometimes blue should win, <laughs> and they give it to red. We've all been there, so. Um, that's just, you know. I think here you just gotta do this. <laughs> in America, that's what you gotta yeah, do. Yeah, I mean, it, it should be quality shot to show effect as opposed to just one. So it's the one who loses the, the, the bloodier. The one with the bloody, bloodier loser. Yeah. Yeah. Maybe they like his shorts better than mine. <laughs> <laughs> All right, back to work. Clinch position, I'm just gonna start off in a position where we're all gonna be in the same one, so it's just easy to, to go around, okay? Right hand around the head, his right hand's around my head, okay? My left hand's gonna be over top here, his left hand's gonna be over top there. So we're both pretty much even, okay? I'm no longer gonna be in a fighting stance, so I'm gonna be sort of even, uh, parallel. And I want my, my chest and my hips to be close in, okay? If I'm back too far like this, he could, I could knee him, but he could knee me. So I wanna, I wanna close that off. So in this position, all we really have are side knees, okay? Nothing too, 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 too bad. If I wanna throw a straight knee, I'm gonna have to make space for it, okay? So this position here is, is one way of doing it. That's kind of stalemate. We both have the same position. If I can fight to get this, this hand to over top here, on the inside, I'm gonna try to break that off my head, okay? He's still gonna be trying to grab me with that hand, so I'm gonna have a lot of resistance. He tries to go over top, I'm gonna raise it up. He tries to go underneath, I'm gonna keep my elbow pinned in. So I have control of his arm here and control of his head. So in that case, I'm going to be the one with the advantage. Here, we're both the same. Okay, I can knee and he can knee me. We both have control of the head, and we're just hanging on here. Okay, if I can break this off inside, he's trying to grab me, so I have resistance here. I can I can twist him and turn him a lot easier by having control of that arm. Okay, so I want to see you guys just kind of pull around a little bit in this position and try to fight for this position. If you can get this position, hold that, and then kind of take it in turns and, and, and try it for both of you. Okay, from that position, and then we're gonna work some, some stuff from there. 